everybody here is the final version uh, this is what I'll actually be sending to anybody who wants a copy of it uh, I have put this up on Thingiverse if you didn't come from there uh, I will be putting a link in the description uh, if you have a 3d printer or know somebody who does please feel free to grab the file and print one of these out uh, if you don't I'll be sending them out for probably like 15 bucks uh, and that just covers time material shipping and every anything uh, I will ship outside the US if you needed to um, some modifications since the last version. This little piece that it, that protrudes here helps keep it from catching on here. Uh, it's not to say it's a hundred percent fixed, but it is a lot better than the previous version and a whole heck of a lot ver better than the OEM. Come on, focus for me here, camera. Um, but to show you it, go. So even with my top that's all stretched out because of the OEM, it just it glides right over, and the the driver's side, which isn't as bad, you'll see, uh, let's see here, is just smooth as silk. So if yours isn't doing this yet, I recommend doing something about it before yours starts doing this, because I use the top a lot. So let me give you another angle here on this. I'm going to open it a little more. You can see, oh, too much light. Sorry, um, it's uh, it's a little bit skinnier on this part here because of the angle that it comes up, and you need it, need it to to hit everything uh, right on on top. Um, and we get the original here. Here is the factory version, um, and there's nothing wrong with it other than it doesn't really work. So we'll put it right next to mine, and you'll notice that mine's actually a little shorter. Um, you need, but even though it's shorter, it extends out this way, out out towards the uh, bar farther. Uh, it does meet all the clearance clearances needed. But why did I make it shorter? Well, this piece actually goes up and rubs against the fabric in here somewhere. Fortunately, it rubs against uh, I think this belt. Which this belt is pretty darn tough, and that's why I don't think there's any wear and tear on it, and I don't think they're really worried about it. But since their part is flat on the top, and I think that was the idea behind it being flat on the top, it's not going to cause as much of an issue. Whereas mine is not flat on the top. So mine, I, I made it shorter so that it doesn't rub on the top at all. So there's really not any chance of it damaging the top that way. At least I hope not. Um, this is all smoothed out. Um, I do recommend a very light sand. Um, if you're printing one out yourself and anything I ship out, I will, of course, sand for folks. so They don't have to worry about all that. But uh, all right, guys. Uh, yeah, uh, that's all I got. I'll probably post a couple of just static pictures on the end of this video.